travel well here. Impressive. All right, let's roll. Is David here? No, he's not. Good. All right, get someone else to start this thing off. Just, just talk about what you expect today and the plan of this location. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's, uh, you know, this this will be our biggest workload of, the, you know, of our work up here. Obviously, we'll practice separately tomorrow, but, yeah, it's a chance for the your first group to get a lot of reps. So, you know, in a, I'd say in a 16 play period, they'll get they'll get at least 10 reps. And it's just really to get the quality of work. Um, so uh, I'm excited to get this this opportunity for our football team. Will Moody be a trade-on coach? Uh, CD will go. Well, I think I think Russell just is you know a championship quarterback. The game's never over. I think you know I think that's a huge compliment that you can give the you know the, the really ties to the great ones. So uh, can make all the throws, dynamic you know ex play extension. So uh, once again, I think this will, this will be great work for our defense. Coach, the Broncos really haven't done seven seven on seven in a while. Once again, so um, how what what's the plan for today and how do you feel like that? Uh, we'll have some seven on seven for you. So, but uh, the, the team periods are really what we're here for. Uh, what are your long term plans or why you think you're going to work with the passing game? I just want to see the, you know, the competition, you know, frankly, you know, the timing and the spacing in the passing game. You know, it, it's a chance to, you know, go, go, you know, we've been going against ourselves now these last, you know, six padded practices. So this is the closest opportunity to get, get, get you know, get to game speed. So, you know, I just want to see our guys grow. Just we, we're here to improve. So, and I, I think just the way this thing's laid out is uh, it's going to be great work today. Uh, definitely. I, I, mean, I had an opportunity to come over here last night just to see the facility and spend a lot of time with Nathaniel. So uh, just so excited for, for him. And, you know, obviously the whole Hackett family is, means the world to me personally. And, and, you know, they've been like family to me. And I, I, I wouldn't be standing here if it wasn't for Paul Hackett. So, um, yeah, the, the whole personal part of it is is awesome. But just, uh, but you know, we're here to work today. And I know Nathaniel wants to get good work. and uh, But really excited for this opportunity he has. I mean, at this point, in camp definitely. I mean, this will be the closest not only for Dak, but but for all of us. Yeah. So, uh, and, and that's the design of it, you know. And, the, and following into next week, so we'll see how this goes. I'm not, you know, this this is new for us. So this is a little bit of a leap, and um, you know, definitely feel about the feel great about the team and the coaching staff and, and that we're doing it with. And so, uh, we're just here to have a real positive experience. Just haven't been part of them. Just you know, just didn't fit. Uh, just didn't fit the training camp. Schedule plan, you know, philosophy of how, how I've operated in the past, and you know, this is something new, and, and so once again, I we're excited about this opportunity. Well, I mean, we both, you know, we're all, you know, we're both practicing with you know, player safety at the at the forefront. So, you know, I'm, I'm anticipating our practice today won't look much different than, than the way we practiced back in Oxnard. So we're not going to hit the quarterback. So. <laughs> yeah, so. any, any message to the team about fighting? Or Absolutely, we don't want we don't want the fights. You know, we're not here to fight. That's that's not. Uh, I, I don't view it as toughness. So I mean, it's uh, you know, if you, if you throw a punch, you're, you're ejected from the game. So same rules apply here today. Yeah, definitely. I, I think traveling, being being on the road you know, together, you know, I, I think these are great moments for culture, bonding, group dynamics, you know, I, and and uh, and have encouraged them to do so. So, I think their time together at dinner tonight is, you know, it's it's always those side off campus conversations. There's a lot of value in that. Uh, when you when you talk about culture, it has to be organic. So I mean, you can't plan everything. Uh, the grown men, uh, they enjoy being around each other. I mean, there's a lot of excitement in our, in our in our meetings this morning. So, you know, it's, uh, once again, it's, we're here for all the right reasons. And, you know, I, I want to see our guys compete. Well, this kind of thing uh, gives you a chance to perhaps look more controlled than you would in a game situation. Have you had conversations with the Broncos coaching staff to kind of tweak and dial some things in as to deal with chemistry? I think it's just more of just, just staying uh, within guidelines. You know, I mean, you know, it's obviously, you know, they're, they, they want they want to get work, and we're not trying to out scheme anybody today. I mean, that's not, you know, I want to see our guys play. Uh, you know, I want to see good, clean looks. You know, I, you definitely don't want to get in a situation where, 
the field's tilted one way or the other schematically. So uh, this is just by getting clean looks and watching our guys compete. At the end of the day, I mean, it's just when you get into real football, when you go go beat the good teams, you know, you got to play better in areas, technique, fundamental, and the competitive spirit, you know, pace operation, all those things. And this gives us a chance to get started what in that direction. What makes it the great evaluation? It's on grass. Uh, it's the AFC. A lot of great things. No, it's uh, I think just it's a quality football team, and, and, and obviously I think that we, we have, we're like-minded on how we train, so uh, how we view the game. So I think that all, all, the, all those things were very attractive to me. Say again? Patrick Taylor, um, just obviously spent a lot of time on him coming out. I think he's, you know, off to a good start, a chance to compete against him last year. I think he's a fine young player. Well, I think it definitely comes from his dad. I mean, it's, you know, that, that's the starting point for all of us, you know, and, you know, we're all disciples of the, you know, the West Coast offense and the system and, the, you know, the principles. So I, I know the training of the quarterback is, is something that's probably pretty similar. But, uh, but yeah, I, I think Paul deserves all the credit here. Yeah, I mean, excited about it. I told our team, you know, when the Cowboys come to town, uh, town it's a big deal. But, you know, obviously Broncos have fabulous uh, fans. And I know Nathaniel was talking, you know, probably see close to 7,000 people here today. So, uh, we, you know, we're excited for the work. We're obviously always excited to be in front of our fans. Thank you. All right, thank you. Thank you.